I am Anil Kumar. Let me thank all the viewers and subscribers for watching my videos and posting excellent questions. Now these two questions have come from students who are probably preparing for their test on logarithms. Question number one. Describe how the graph of y equals to log of 10,000x is related with y equals to log of x. And question number two is, to solve the logarithmic equation, log of square root of x square minus 1 equals to 2. I hope the solution of these questions will help many of the students. You can actually pause the video, try them out, and then look into my suggestions. Let's solve the first one. y equals 2. We are given y equals 2. Now, uh, there are four zeros. 10,000, right? Log of 10 to the power of 4. 1, 2, 3, 4 zeros. Times x. We could always write this using the logarithmic rules in product form. So we could write this as log of 10 to the power of 4 plus log of x, correct? And now we can apply the power rule and write this as 4 times log of 10 plus log of x. What is 4 log of 10? Well, this logarithm is to the base 10, right? And therefore, 4 log of 10 should be equal to just 4, right? So let me add one more step here. So I'll add right 4 plus log of x. Now once you get to this form, you can actually describe the transformation very easily. Perfect. So it is 4 units translated up. And now the transformation will be, so the answer will be, translate 4 units vertically. upwards. So the log graph will be translated 4 units vertically upwards to match with this. That's what we try to say, right? <clears throat> Translate 4 units vertically upwards. Question number 2. So that's kind of a shortcut answer you could describe as you wish. Question number 2. Solve log square root of x square minus 1 equals to 2. Now this logarithmic equation, let me rewrite this. Log square root of x square minus 1 equals to 2. Now in this case, we know there is only one restriction that x is not equal to plus minus 1. That will make this 0, but all of the values are valid. <coughs> So we get the equation log to the base 10 of square root of x square minus 1 equals to 2. We can write this in exponential form. So we get square root of x square minus 1 equals to 10 to the power of 2. Right? Now you can square both sides. So we get x square minus 1 equals to 10 to the power of 4. You can add 1. So we get x square equals to 10 to the power of 4 is like 4 zeros, right? And then I'm adding 1. So we get 10,001. So let me take it to this side. So we get x square equals to 10,001, right? So three zeros and then one. So what is x equal to? x equals to square root of all this. So that becomes your answer. So there are two solutions to this particular equation, which is x equals to plus minus square root of three zeros, 10,001. So I hope these solutions help you to understand feel free to write your comments and share your views if you like and subscribe to my videos that'd be great thanks for watching and all the best